neighbors. More dogs. From the noisiest neighborhood in the known universe. It just got a little bit noisier. Welcome to Smoky Goodness. Hey, today we're going to uh, be jumping on the Jalapeno Popper bandwagon. Uh, I think this was started by Keith Bettag, the vulgar chef Bettag. Hope I'm pronouncing that right. Sorry, Keith, if I'm not. Now, we're doing jalapeno peppers, and you may or may not remember the uh, cream cheese kick bison burger thing I did a few weeks ago. We're going to be doing that with a jalapeno popper. And in lieu of bison, we're going to be using some smoked chicken that we did here a few days ago. It's going to be really good. Let's get everything started. Stick around, Herb. Hey, look who's back. <laughs> what you going to do, light the coals? Yeah. All right, let's get to it. There we go. There he is, ladies and gentlemen. The finest fire starter that ever started a fire. I'm pretty sure you're familiar with the procedure. A modus operandi. Coals off to one side. And of course, because this recipe involves bacon, it also has to involve a drip pan, a makeshift drip pan. Right? Okay, and as the grill grate begins to heat up before I clean it, let's get the ingredients involved ready. I will introduce the ingredients as they come into play. We're gonna begin with ranch dressing. And I'm just eyeballing the uh, amounts here. The cream cheese, I want to go probably equal amounts of this. So, doing that. This is the uh, jalapeno, stuffed jalapeno popper version of my uh, kicking bison burger without bison this time. Let's see what we're putting in. Well, I told you already, right? Next, in addition to the original recipe, you gotta have sriracha on everything. Am I right? Am I right, Angie? I'm right. All right, just give it all a good mix. Next item, of course, our jalapenos. I'm just gonna cut the tops of these off. going to uh, core them out a little bit. I don't have a, an effective apple core, so bear with me, this could take a while. <laughs> okay, you want to get all the seeds out. Preferably for me, it wouldn't matter. I mean, I, I love the seeds. All right, I'll finish these up. We'll be right back. Next item, some smoked chicken. We are simply gonna stuff these jalapeno poppers with some smoked chicken. Get it in there good. Maybe not that much. Chicken goes right into the poppers. And we're just gonna pipe in some of that deliciousness right into the popper, just like that. All right, shut up, Doc. We 
got a good hot fire going. And because I can't stand these things up in that rack, those holes are too small, I'm going to uh, just kind of butt them up together like this. Just like that. Okay, I'm still not done. The bacon on these poppers is going to be candy sriracha. I'm gonna melt some brown sugar on those. And what's left of those. And we'll be back in a little while with some sriracha. Oh man, simple as that. All right, we're about an hour, hour and five minutes into this. Oh yeah. As promised, lay a bead, Mr. Smoky Goodness Guy. You gotta have candy sriracha bacon on your poppers, man. Shut up, dog. New dog. All right, I'm gonna heat that up for a little while. Flip them over, lay another bead, pull them off, it'll be time to eat. The time has come. Oh, 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 baby, look at those. Lost a little bit, not a whole lot. Want to be good. Hey, where'd the bacon go? It's right there. Looks like we're back to eating good in the neighborhood. <laughs> Welcome back, eating good. Welcome back, family. Anyway, there's our hot sriracha infused cream cheese ranch dressing. I don't know what to call this thing yet. Poppers. <laughs> Got some Chinese rice over there. What do we have back in the background? I see some corn. Salad and Salad chicken. and the rest of that chicken. Delicious. Chicken's delicious. Yeah. I've been looking forward to this all week. I win, I win. <laughs> Noisiest neighborhood in the known universe, new dog. Now shut up.